I wouldn't know. Oh, gross. Ah, you mean Zenless Zone Zero drag? Yeah, who, who knows when that'll come out? It's it's a mystery. They've been working on that one for a while. That's specifically their Singapore studio, so they can you know do whatever they want, including show gratuitous amounts of titty. I'm also a little annoyed, uh, learning about the Signalis patch that's coming out, or came out, that I will never get to see, because fucking goddamn it, Microsoft. Uh, yeah, the, uh, the latest Signalis patch basically makes two important things not take up inventory slots in this game with painfully limited inventory. Also, there's an option to adjust your inventory capacity. But I'm not gonna see it because I'm using the Game Pass version because I didn't have the 20 bucks to buy the, the normal version. The normal version, the Steam version, or Humble, either one, but yeah, I didn't have the 20 bucks to do it, so it's like, oh. And because it's gonna be gone on November 1st, uh, I'll never get to see that patch! Because the Microsoft cert process is infamous for being awful.
and taking forever. Hey, Nave, fuck you. Fuck you, Nave. For reference, I'm saying fuck you, Nave, everyone. Because Nave is the one who drew this patch to my attention. In the Discord. The patch that I'm bitter about. Hey, Carmine. Uh, because the Microsoft cert process is a fucking nightmare, Lulade, in any patch uh, that needs to go through them takes infinitely longer to get through because of it. So I probably won't see the 1.2 patch before it leaves fucking Game Pass. Yeah, it sucks, Carmine. And it's a shame because one of the things it lets me do is adjust the fucking inventory size. Another is that it makes two items uh, not take up inventory space. Yeah, it's it's really fucked up, Marathian. They also don't want you touching any of them. Uh, so the on on computer, they deliberately fuck with the fucking rights, the user, the user privileges. You cannot touch them. They are their own tier of privilege beyond admin, and they are untouchable. Clearly, Nave. Clearly. Ah, finally, I'm part of Nave's family. I've wormed my way in. What the fuck is
I love the sound of number stations. They're not at all eerie. Oh, that's sweet, Nave. To be fair, I stream a lot. Oh, right. I should probably get moving. Ugh. Oh, right. I forgot to do something. I forgot to do something I frequently forget to do. Number stations are fucking uncomfortable. I understand what they do and the purpose they serve, but they're fucking uncomfortable. I hate them. I don't know why they play a fucking recording of a number station at the start. Uh, I've been enjoy- what, what the fuck? Go away. <laughs> you didn't see that. Uh, I've been enjoying it so far. Oh fuck, right. I need to whip out this bad boy. That's what I call my phone. Uh, last time I left off, I beat the first boss. Uh, in a way that kind of actually really was embarrassing for the boss. My problem is they just introduced a really interesting patch that I can't take advantage of. Okay, there we go. I have the thing I needed up. And yeah, hel hello, Fenfell. I'm so tired of number stations. <sighs> I think this is where I left off. It is the inventory patch. You're correct. Because I'm playing this on Game Pass and the Microsoft cert process takes forever. Uh, they let you set the amount of inventory slots you have, I think, in the settings. Uh, not that you can here. They also make two specific items not take up inventory space. Yes, the flashlight. And another item. But also, one thing I want to show quick. Because I saw this uh, last time when I wanted to make, when I went to uh, make sure I saved and realized I did save, so I closed it. Here's what happens if you continue without saving. Yeah. You'll regret this later. It's very dumb. I love it. That reminds me, how am I doing on inventory? Uh, piss poor. I don't think I'm gonna need the thermite for a hot minute. Yeah, it's it's really great, Marathian, and once again, number of stations are fucking uncomfortable. I hate them. I think they're fascinating, but I hate them. Where did we leave off? Oh right, we fell down the funny pit. Not to be confused with the money pit. It's full of dead people. Speci specifically, uh, Lister units. I'm not calling them Elster, they're Lister. Elster's a dumb name, with their Lister. Okay, anything fun in here? Oh, what the? Italy, fuck. Okay. I, I, I don't think I had the fuse chat. Okay, we got, we got pushed, all right? We got pushed aggressively, 
violently by a rude man. But you know what? I was trying to be reasonable about it. Even though I really had no point in being reasonable about it. Honestly, I should have been angrier. But you know what? I'm a reasonable person. Not really. Oh no. We have layers. Locked effective. Lock effective. This shit. Oh no. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, angry note. I'm officially sick of Yul's next door. They even listen to that stupid song nonsense. Oh no. If I hear it one more time, I'm going over there and smashing that stupid tape recorder to piece. No, 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 no. I wonder if there's a way we can borrow a key so we can get to their dorm and put an end to this madness. I don't care about breaking quarantine if it means never having to hear that song again. I got a bad feeling. I got a bad feeling about that song and what it's going to mean for me. Booyan will burn. I don't know what Booyan is, but sure, I'm down for it. Uh, yeah, you know what? I don't need to shower today. I can shower tomorrow? You speed up, motherfucker. Okay, I see glitching. Not huge on that. Okay, we're good. Lighting malfunctions. Oh no. Yeah, I, uh, if you're seeing that occasionally, I think I know what's happening. Oh, you, you get to get shunted off to the darkness dimension. You're not allowed to be real anymore. Due to a recent incident involving a certain starling that shall remain unnamed, I've adjusted all doors. Oh no. No, 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 no. Fuck piss shit. Fine, if I don't acknowledge them, they won't acknowledge me. Okay, so we're gonna just, uh, uh, yeah, I don't know, like, just use a bit of that. Good enough for now. Ooh, what a funny hole. Replica. All-purpose general worker. Replica macaw. Generation 2 low-cost general purpose. Uh, mechanical titanium reinforced poly, uh, polyethylene shell. Height. 185? Uh, that's, that's a solid height! Yes, Bray Bray, you've done some digging and what?
Uh, the tough worker bees of the construction repair industry, one of the early replica designs, the simple but efficient auras are the most produced replica type to date. These strong and heavy worker units are perfect fit for work in construction and production of industrial goods. Many places throughout our nation, auras have replaced all gestalt workers in fields like climate forming and explosive ordnance disposal. Cool! Why is there just like a boat? Later, bitch! I'm out. Then don't spoil anything. I don't trust that man at all. Cool. Yeah, I'm down for more repair spray. Let's fucking go. More ammo? Fuck yeah. That reminds me. Oh, I, I didn't even notice her there. Oh, that's chill. Oh, you bitch, you can fucking lunge! No. She can fucking lunge! I don't need to shoot them. for this replacement part has been approved and was processed by S23 management. Please find the enclosed requested part for installation. Uh, Falk has specifically requested the repair of the looping lift system to be prioritized over the others. Please replace the fuse as soon as possible. It's a huge hassle for everyone to get around without it. Damn fucking straight! Ugh. I have space for it. I mean, the answer is everyone's just burning through all their ammunition and leaving nothing for me. It's fucked up, right? gonna chill here in the dark room. Why two ammo? The fuck is wrong with these people? I mean, it takes two bullets to drop an enemy if you have the space. <laughs> Damn. 
Damn, if only I had a gate handle. Stay down, bitch! Man, I am just plowing through ammo. Look at all this ammo I have left. One bullet! Ah, oh, damn, I hope that printer's not out of toner. That- Oh, I didn't even notice her. Oh, fuck off. Not in the mood to deal with your shit today, ma'am. One nine sixty, I think it said. Well, that's that's pleasing. Yeah, that, uh, that felt great. I'm not 100% sure on how I was supposed to figure that out. Oh, there's a keyhole in the painting. Ooh. Ooh, saucy. But, you know, maybe flashing a three digit number, well, technically five digits, count the, uh, And the decimal. Either way, kind of was the dead giveaway. I still, I, I, I think it was supposed to give away which one was the thing to shoot. But like, man, did I turn off my radio? I did. Fucking hate that radio. Don't mind me, ma'am. I am just here in the background. Uh, gently slathering coagulant all over my body. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You fucking would. Bitch. Yeah, clearly, VOD. I'm not angry. I'm not bitter. <clears throat> Ooh. I wonder if they brought me my mail. Damn, I can't check. Also, chat, just know that be glad I call them the Lister units and not the Lester units as they deserve to be named. That's all I'm saying, chat. I think it was floor five that I need to go up to. Later, bitch. Elster's dumb, Bray Bray. Fuck that. They're Lister units. Elster doesn't even make sense. Doesn't work. They're Lister units. Lister the unlikely. Actually, I'll be back in one second. I had a lot to drink before this.
Okay, I'm back. First off, Wang, you're wrong. It's Lister. There's no E. It's the same reason it's not Elster. Boosh. I'm so good at video games chat. You can go ahead and do that, Carmine. It, it doesn't bug me. Also, I want y'all to know uh, that my window still screams louder than any of those those Lister units. And you'll be like, Torpa, what the fuck do you mean by it screams louder than the Lister units? Well, you see, chat, one of my windows, for some reason, shrieks like the devil every time I open it. It is the worst, loudest, most unholy squeak I have ever fucking heard. I have Anora. That's the fun part. WD40 didn't cure the shriek. Though it did make the window glide so much more smoothly. I don't live in Silent Hill, I'm too far south. By which I mean, like, I, I'd probably be like three hours out from Silent Hill. I could drive three hours and end up in Silent Hill. Which, like, why would I do that? What have I got to prove? Yeah, congrats, Brainy, at being up way too fucking late. No, I, I, I have made peace with my fucking shrieking window. Hope for the future rot front is not a phrase I care for. Yeah, I don't know what purpose activating that did. Time to go check over here. Wait, no, I think this is just another room. Yeah, uh, it's just another room. Yeah, right, Tyrion? It's fucking weird. I'm pretty sure my window is possessed, but I, as I said, I've made peace with that. He's like, yeah, I, I had to open my fucking window because it's not getting warm in here, but I wanted it to cool off a little bit. Is I am a creature of the cold. It's not that cold at the moment, actually. It's it's very chill. Wait, did I not pick up those stun batons in the other place? Whatever. Absolute bitch. And she can pull a fucking fast one on me. Great. Nothing gained, nothing lost except for health. Also, chat, I want you to know, to really help you figure, like, understand what is going through my head at the moment. While playing this game, I have the song Party Dog by uh, Tom Cardi stuck in my head. 
And it's it's really, really helping to, uh, we'll say, like, provide some uh, outstanding flavor to my experience of this game. Playing this horror game as a song about petting a dog at a party. And also the immigration status of the Vatican plays in my head. Aha! I have mastered the terrain unlike you, peasant. Aha! Exactly, drag, you get it? No, Bray Bray. All I'm saying is listen listen to the song Party Dog by Tom Cardi. It's very good. But also just know that it is completely flavoring my experience at the moment. Ah, the Fuckler. Biomechanical with polyethylene shell and bolt resistant armor plating. Mm -hmm. Height, 250 centimeters. That's a tall ass lady. I'm down for it. The protector, uh, Führung's commandos. Commander? I, I don't know, man. I don't fucking claim to understand any German. It's all nothing to me. The head of each Eon facility's protector force is uh, a powerful prototype bioresonant Falk unit. Or Falka. Whatever. I don't know, man. An authority that may never be questioned, a, a Falk unit. Uh, serves not just as a commander to the protectors, but as a nearly godlike being, a perception that is underlined by her tall build and resemblance to our nation's leaders, the Great Revolutionary and her daughter. I'm sorry, were the Great Revolutionary and her daughter fucking tall as shit? Is also aided by a powerful prototype bioresonance module, which not only allows her to bend the will of weaker minds and fathom their intentions and emotions, but also grants her the ability to manipulate objects from a distance. Ah, she's a psychic motherfucker. This shit. Why are there so many items in this room for me to grasp with my fingies? False diary. I don't know how much longer I have to go on. I do not want to live anymore as what I've become. The red eye beyond the gate showed me. No, touched me. Poisoned me. Feels like my mind has been contaminated, defiled by another person's memory. I know I'm no longer fully myself, but I've not fully become someone else either. I'm stuck here between her and me, with half-formed dreams and recollections recollections tainting penetrating my brain. Fuck, I can't read, and tainting my every action. Who is she? Who is that white-haired girl? I don't fucking know. Why do I long to see her again? Why would she curse me like this? Because fuck you. That's cool, Bray Bray, but it's Lister. I refuse to hear anything to the contrary. Chat, I cannot emphasize how sad I am that I don't have access to the inventory patch.
Ma'am, you uh you wanna give me? Give me that? Wait, wait, no, 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 wait, 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 chat. I, I think I let me let me check my notes. I have notes that I can check. Fuck. My notes are worthless. They just say, you are a bitch for some reason. Don't worry about it, Nave. Well, that's awkward. Whatever, losers. I will be back, bitch! Look, all I'm saying, chat, is I get to hear in my brain me a man talk about how in the census there, there is a big fat fresco of him with one hand in dip and the other hand on a corgi. Wait, you died? No. Bitch. Okay. I'm going back for the goodies. Yeah, no, it's great, because I knew exactly what the king in yellow was the second I saw it. I'm like, I don't want to pick that up. And it's like, you got to pick that up. I'm like, I don't want to pick that up. But the game is like, no, you stupid motherfucker, you gotta pick that up. I'm like, I don't, I don't want to pick it up. But it was too late. I picked it up. It was always too late, chat. I... Don't read a lot, but I know Eldritch stuff. I know... Okay. Let's not even fucking dance around. I know Lovecraft and shit. Yeah, Pope of Patent Party Dog. That's his job. Murders is a very kind way of putting it. Though I do like the image. Oh. <laughs> Mineta, the ocean world ravaged by war. When I close my eyes, I can hear the sound of the sea. It has the Red Desert. Imperial fleet can only hold it for so long before it will be liberated. Buyan, the home to the Imperial Palace floating above poisonous clouds. Rotfront, the ice moon circling the largest gas giant. Still in the process of climaforming. Hey, I think that's where we started the game! An orrery showing a rotating view of the current relative uh, position, positions of the inhabited worlds of the solar system. Fun. Okay, that, that's it? That's chill. I'm sure it'll be needed for a- you know what? Just in case. Putting that one away in the notes! Yeah, I, I, I clicked Booyan. See? Look, we, we don't talk about that, Bray. I just call it Eldritch Horror. Some people call it Cosmic Horror. That's also valid. Not what I call it, but I'm not... I mean, I, fucking... Same hat, really. Oh, this is awkward. Hey, ma'am, you want to talk it out? Do we, we gotta be, do we gotta be enemies? You know what, I'm leaving.
Shut the fuck up, Knave. I have immediately forgotten where I needed to go. Here we go. Time to drop off this crank. Hey! Oh no. Okay, I'm just gonna keep talking while we're in this fucking room. Because every time I hear classical music in this game, that's where the real terror kicks in. The real fucking horror of this game is dodging DMCA. Because, my god, it haunts me no matter where I go. Uh... How am I doing on shotgun ammo? Hmm... And I guess I can do a tradesies. And we do a little bit of this. Euler. Uh, generation 4, low cost, general purpose, biomechanical poly uh, polyethylene shell. 175 centimeters. Euler units are the backbone of Yusan Nation's workforce. These elegant multi-purpose worker units are sued for all kinds of domestic tasks like cleaning, cooking, and some medical and office work. Uh, Yules are highly social and get along well with each other, as well as most other replica models. While unfit for combat, their lightweight frame makes them a prime choice for constant facility for distant facilities where supplies are limited. Good for them, I guess. Yeah, right? It's terrifying. Everyone knows that the C in DMCA stands for Cthulhu. That's right. Digital Millennium Cthulhu Act. They don't want you to know that though, so they call it copyright. But they're all- No! Go away! Not in the mood! I'm going upstairs. I'm gonna cry. Fuck. No, no, no. It tragically does not stand for con. Though it is used by them. For the love of God. Hey, we, we don't need to be enemies. Bitch! Could have been friends. Or at least we could have been neutral. I would have been down for some good old fashioned neutrality. But no. No, you gotta freak the fuck out every time you see me. Heaven fucking forbid. Can't just, you know, talk it out like goddamn fucking functioning adults. No. You gotta make a scene every goddamn time. Oh, there's a map, huh? Well, I don't care. Okay, so I think it's floor six. And it's that door, the one I'm po- oh, oh. Fuck! Okay, but what about- I, are we- We're five, two. One. Damn. Look, I'm just saying, I didn't want to, like, be enemies. We didn't need to be friends, okay? You don't got to be friends with everyone. That's fucking fine. I don't give a shit. Okay, so girls are going to pop out of the floor here. I'm betting good money on it. Ooh. Oh, they were really fucking rip shit about that music. God fucking damn. 
Ladies, do not fuck around. Can I use this mirror? Oh, mirror. A reflection. Somehow it feels very unfamiliar. Yeah, you, you get used to it, though. They'll never not feel weird. Okay, where to next? Say what you will, I respect their dedication to stabbing a fucking speaker. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. The shape's not quite an 8-track. But it's close. Eight tracks are a little more square from what I remember. Ladies. Ladies. Hey chat. <sighs> Can we talk about bad design? Uh, let's check it out. Adler. Biomechanical with polyethylene shell and titanium skeleton. Height, 175 centimeters. Aww. Not even that tall. An integral part of every protector, whatever, is the administrator unit. A single Adler unit can manage and oversee all administrative tasks for an entire facility, freeing other operational command units to focus on the other direct control of protector units. On the direct control of the protector units, excuse me. The Alder is designed to work as a direct counterpart to the Falk unit, serving as her adjutant by taking care of necessary paperwork and calculations. Sick. Uh, but where in his programming does him being a bitch factor in? Later, ho! Wanna talk it out? Why you gotta make a scene? I don't wanna be enemies. I mean, is, is there another way to say it? Like, that's how I know how to say it. Uh, I'm not blowing through seven fucking ammo. Fuck. Let's just wait a little bit for the heat to die down.
I'm out, hoes! part about the aiming mechanic is if you're not careful it'll just start switching between enemies no Whatever. Whatever! What is that one on the left? Is it supposed to be like some... fucked up version of like Saturn eating his son or whatever the fuck it's called? Aha, loser. Each cadre of protectors, the protector security technicians, is overseen by a control unit, the most common which stork type, tallest replica models. 240 centimeters, goddamn. Biomechanical polyethylene shell and bolt resistant armor plating. Mars eating his son or what? I fucking know. Alright, whatever. Uh, right to direct and coordinate security technicians. They're tough, no nonsense demeanor, though sometimes described as brutal and even cruel, makes them perfect. How does that make them a perfect fit? Fucking audacity of these bitches. Later, ho. Oh, fuck. Later, bitch. We come in here and wait a little bit for them to reset. This shit. And we wait for them to reset. Now I need to remember which floor the safe room is in. I think it's this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck off. Ma'am, I'm not in the mood. I have better shit to do than contend with your fucking bullshit.
Stay the fuck down! Every one of you. Y'all need to learn how to fucking cool it. Just take a nap for a little bit. We don't have to be enemies. I'm not saying we gotta be friends, but we don't gotta be enemies. We don't need to be besties or whatever, but like, come on. Okay, let's just do some fucking cleanup. Oh no, I just, I still have Party Dog stuck in my head. That's all I'm saying. Just remember that everyone has, everyone at a party has a job. And mine is to pet that party dog. Dude, pet that motherfucking party dog. God, that noise is annoying. The Lester, the unlikely units. One, uh, two, who? Anything up here? Okay, I think... I know there were some other shells I had to leave behind. Or did I get all of them? Look, all I'm saying is that, you know, get the dog some cheese, Craig. Honestly, the track that plays in that room specifically reminds me of Yuminiki. You'd be like, Torpo, we get it. You like Yuminiki. I know, but I need to mention it whenever it's possible because I don't mention it enough. And we... No! Oh! Damn you, broken cassette! Can you, can you just like move your fingies? Bitch. One day, chat. Okay, so I think I've cleared out this floor, more or less. At least in so much as I can. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, there's that, then this is library key. I'm assuming that reads library, but I, I can't read German. I'm sorry, chat. Sorry you had to learn this about me, but I, I can't I can't read German. I, I never learned how to read German. It's uh it's something I'm not proud of. Me being an American who grew up in America and never had any real reason to learn German. Uh never learned German. And it's uh it's tragic. Man, you got this. Show me them footsies. Better bitch. Hey, we don't actually need to be enemies. You ignore me, I'll ignore you. Exactly, Marathian. It is a problem. No, foot. 
It's not a feet thing, you weirdo. Oh, God, you people. Why is it always about feet with you? And I get it, you people are on the internet and you're from the internet. But like, oh, piss shit. Oh, fuck. Come on. Come on, chat. Oh yeah, I still have the eidetic module, not that I know what it's for. Fun fact, the eidetic module was the other module that was made, uh, not an inventory item. Ma'am, could you just like, fucking not? People are trying to sleep around here. Fucking ladies. Like, no goddamn respect for their fellow person. We'll call them people. For the sake of argument, we'll call them people. Shit piss. Oh, gotta commit. I did not pack a baton, so there's no point in going there. Ladies? You don't make it weird, I won't make it weird. I wasn't sure if she was friendly or not, so I didn't shoot. Damn girl, you fucking tall. Stop being tall. Ooh. Calibri management office. While well, the Calibri has holed herself up on the management office on the seventh floor, I've seen her and her illusions sitting inside the room crying. Which one is the real one? It's a mystery. And it's because of the painting in there. Whenever I was close to her, it felt like my mind was being assaulted by an image of that island. Sensation was wrong enough to make me hurl. Is there any way to neutralize the transmission? Maybe some sort of feedback loop of the frequency or of her control signal? It's a mystery. Cradle of humanity, Veneta. Oh boy, more shit to fucking fill up my inventory. I'll actually be back in uh, a couple minutes.
You know, I was just thinking about how I've been too afraid to experiment before, but I've noticed one funny thing, is that certain radio stations tend to act up around certain enemies. And I've just been wondering if that was relevant. Hi, I'm back. Oh shit. There's a low hum in the background that occasionally flips on and off, and for some reason I thought that was actually coming from somewhere in my house. I'll show you what I mean. Yeah, Tyrion. Why did I have my controller out? I don't use my controller for this. Yeah, I know a controller was connected. We're not using the controller. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do. So notice how it's... Maybe I'm losing my mind. Because I thought that certain frequencies did react to certain things. Or maybe it's just it always reacts to everything and I was just tuning into certain number stations. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. It's like, at a specific level, if you notice there were... I think what is happening is I'm tapping certain number stations that are needed for certain things. But it's getting horrifically mangled. Uh, cause let's see, about, no, nothing's at the 200 range. Yeah, now it's stabilized. So yeah, that's weird. Uh, being near, near enemies can trigger weird pseudo number stations. Okay, I never saw where to use the workshop key. Or the hunter's key! How am I doing on ammo? I'm decent enough. Later, ho! So yeah, I just, I don't keep the radio on because it's honestly just a little bit annoying. And the music's kind of a dead giveaway anyway, that shit's going down. Unless there's just something I don't know about regarding the radio, I'm content to leave it off. Ladies.
Yeah, okay. Yeah, so I never saw where to use the workshop key or the hunter's key. Oh, right there is workstation. Fuck you, game. Look at all this delicious, delightful ammo. Replica Known Issues Part 2. Brave experience with replica models has given us an insight into irregularities uh, in their behavior that stem from the original neural patterns used for these units. Due to the sensitive nature of the information, this document should be destroyed after reading. Tragically, it wasn't. So instead, we get lore. Uh, Star, despite normally laid back demeanor, despite their normally laid back demeanor, stars have a strong internal hierarchy, which is important to take into consideration when promoting units to officers. Not promoting a respected unit or promoting a unit low in status can lead to friction within dorms. Stars will occasionally develop in-group rules uh, involving physical punishments. It is recommended to allow some officers to own military weapons as fetish objects to stabilize their pe persona. I'm sorry? Are, are you telling me they're into like, they're big into BDSM or some shit? Uh, Storch units initially have a short temper. Training them in patience early after deployment is key as their neural pattern is less stable than other models. Failing to do so may yield an extremely volatile personality prone to cruelty and violence. Common strategy is pairing them closely with an older star unit. Storch's persona stabilizes by showering or bathing. What? Books on history and mythology work well as fetish objects. What? What? Not only are they all lesbians, they're all sadomasochistic lesbians, my god. Oh, uh, yes, that is specifically what they mean. But, like, in regards to inflicting pain and punishment, it uh, certainly does carry a certain other connotation. I forget, is there anything worthwhile in here? Look, all I'm saying is hearing about how these women beat each other up in the shower, it, it ain't great. Oh, good, there are enemies in here. Oh, fuck off. Yeah, that one's on me. Oh, good. I'm not carrying any healing. Honestly, I almost should just fucking reload. But I don't 100% know where my load point is, so... A teensy tiny bit of a crapshoot! Yeah, fuck off, ma'am. God. The problem is, like, I just... I have so many fucking slots at any point dedicated to random crap that I, I just, I can't get rid of. And like, I don't know when I'm gonna need shit, so I can't just like, toss it away. Except for that. That I can toss away.
Okay. Oh yeah, classical music. Shouldn't fucking let that play too long. Whatever. Now we want to go up. You don't see me, you don't see me. I'm invisible! Aha! <laughs> Please, ma'am, path around. Let's just go up. It don't gotta be weird if you don't make it weird. Make it weird, it will be weird. But if you don't make it weird, it won't be weird. All fucking ready? I know when I round the corner, another one pops out. No, I don't really see the need for the auto injector. There it is. Combine with the hunter key. And there we go! The boss killer. What is with this game in fucking adhesive tape? Nothing's wrong with adhesive tape. It's just weird how many problems are solved by adhesive tape in this that it really shouldn't be. I'm gonna be honest. Okay, so I'm gonna need to tune in to 142, is, is what I'm getting. I'm gonna write this down here. Okay, chat, I'm gonna do something really stupid and unnecessary. But I want that fucking magnum ammo! get through here quickly, turn off the light, and leave. Yeah, pretty much, Tyrion. They believe that, like, much like some people believe WD-40 can, it can solve any problem. Which, like, to be fair to the people who believe in WD-40, they're correct. I will die on this hill. WD-40 can solve literally any problem.
This is this is just a fact. No. Adhesive tape. Not really. Also, that looked like fucking like scotch tape. Scotch tape ain't solving shit. Speaking from experience. Man, I don't know what they're hoping to solve with that fucking scotch tape, but it, it ain't nothing. So that went surprisingly painless, so I'm gonna do an override. Okay, so... Uh, next, we are gonna go all the way... I think we need to go down to... We need to go down to eight. Yeah, we need to go down to eight. Problem is, these girls are gonna be back up again. Or not. These ones are gonna wake up, but who gives a shit? I am. We must talk. Clown to clown communication. Oh no 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 This is this is bad. This is going to cause me problems and I need to wait to get the hummingbird key so I can shut off my fucking Ugh. Thanks for the key, homie. They're both terrible, honestly, Anora. Now, like, duct tape, sure, good. But, like, it's not solve every problem good if you don't want it in the way of something. Like, it's not multi-purpose in the way that WD-40 is. Replica Known Issues Part 1. Brief experience with these replica models has given us insight into irregularities in their behavior that stem from original neural patterns used for these units. Due to the sense of nature of this information, this document should be destroyed after reading. Yules tend to form large groups and like to sing and dance, as the original neural pattern for this unit was a ballet dancer. Persona degradation can be easily prevented from this unit by making sure they have access to music through tape players or musical instruments. Always place at least one mirror in Eula dorms, as they have a strong urge to check their own appearance at regular intervals. Uh, Eula's, uh, pers uh, persona stabilizes by keeping a tidy appearance and through regular social interactions. Uh, Eula's will be organized in groups of roughly 10 units and give each other themed nicknames. Uh, Arar. Even though they seem like quiet simpletons, do not underestimate Arars. Or Aras. While I may not show it, they judge those who are crude or unkind harshly, uh, and will quietly share this judgment with their entire cadre. Aras get along best with Yules, who tend to be patient and friendly, and have a talent for reading Aras' expressionless faces. In many facilities, Aras will uh, construct service tunnels accessible only to them, often under floors or in walls. Uh, unstable units may retreat into these tunnels. It is not recommended to attempt to retrieve them. Our personas can be stabilized by allowing them access to plants to take care of, ideally colorful flowers or trees. They really do, Nave, and I, you know what, I respect that. I respect the party droid. Every time, they love just, like, the Calibri. Biomechanical with polyethylene shell and bolt-resistant armor plating. Height, 152 centimeters. They show. Marvel modern technology, the Calibri is the most capable bioresonance unit ever produced. 
Every protector of Furin Commando's Falk unit is aided by a cadre of Calibri units, uh, Calibri unit adjutants, uh, which can amplify her bioresonant signals as well as produce their own. Despite their diminutive build, Calibris are the most effective protector units. Able to directly influence the minds of replicas and gestalts, extract information non-verbally, and communicate among themselves instantly in the full bandwidth of senses, the Calibri's bioresonance bio is the closest recreation of a true hive mind. I don't like it! Calibri's a note. Keep an eye on Adler, he's hiding something from us. There was nothing in his diary, but when I probed his mind, there are memories of a Lister unit uh, working on Sierpinski. There's no record of that model of replica ever being deployed here. An order for a single unit for some survey work in the mine was briefly considered, but no new orders were made due to the commander's signet. Is that us? We want 105. God, I, I think I hate that enemy. Like, is it the worst? Not really, but it's fucking annoying. God, is it annoying. Maybe the Calibri should never have been fucking corrupted or whatever. I'm glad I can't just drop items. Thank you, game. Cause like, I don't need the stun prod. You know what? I know what I can do. Who wants to get tased? Hey, bitch. Okay. No, the Calibri's gone. Tragically, Professor Dog, my taser's already gone. I'm sorry it was too late to fulfill your weird pervert dreams. You'll just have to make do with the card battery and alligator clamps. Sorry. Not my problem, though. I'm gonna get back up and I'm gonna be very miffed. And do we have to have this, like, every time we meet? Look, man, Nave, some people are just perverts. It's okay. If someone wants to get off on being tased directly in the Nards, that's between them and God. That's not my problem. I will only kink shame very specific things. That is surprisingly not one of them. Okay, good. I didn't really, really receive any damage from the Calibri. Later, ho! Okay, this is not the floor, then I think it's the floor above us that I'm looking for. God, I am good. Okay. What number is that? Uh, let's inspect. Five on two. The 
Lebrarby key. Hey chat, I know we saw where to use the eagle key and I don't remember where. Do any of you remember? Out of curiosity. The eagle key. I do like this track, though. Because I know we saw somewhere to use it, I just don't remember where. I have a vague recollection. Not here, but I'm just looking in here just in case. Not here. Because I distinctly remember it being one of the later rooms we went into, so it'd be probably somewhere on either 8 or 7. Yeah, it may have been near the bedridden lady. Like over here is not my problem. Was it somewhere in here? No. Where the fuck? I'll check the, the bed lady, the blady if you would. She's like bed man, but a lady. So, nothing like Bedman. The Babe Lady, the B Lady. So yeah, those are all that one unit we saw, the, uh, the Ara. The ones that are popping up from the floor. I'm guessing the generic units we're seeing are the, the Aras? Yeah, that's... Yeah, you know what? No, not in the mood for that. Is it in here? No, that wouldn't make any sense. This is where I got. Yeah. Fuck me running. Where is it? So like, I see the library, there's the store dorm, the library bedroom. Like, I don't remember where I need the eagle key. Wait, do I need the eagle key for the mine shaft or the alder bedroom? The Adler bedroom. Lady. 
ladies. Yeah, I had a feeling. Okay, Adler's Diary. I have been fascinated by a peculiar piece of furniture I discovered in storage. A strange box with a removable dial in the front that was confiscated from a worker some time ago. I was instantly drawn to it, though I'm not sure why. When I put my ear on the mechanism, I faintly- I hear- can you hear a faintly clicking like a clock? I can hear it faintly clicking like a clock. Yeah. Without Calibri's help, it has become much harder to coordinate the logistics cadre. Uh, if there is any good- if there's anything good to say about that woman, is she knows how to take care of others, respect her orders, disp and take make others respect her orders despite her minuscule stature. I went to see her today, but her room is still locked. I had a dream tonight. Another memory of my gestalt life, I believe. I was wearing my uniform. There was a young woman, her hair white as snow, and I was conducting some sort of test. I had a deck of cards with astronomical symbols on them and asked her to guess the planet on the card I was holding. No! That, that one other unit... The, the one that was in the bed also mentioned seeing a white-haired lady, so... I was playing with that mechanical lockbox again, of which I'm now sure is some kind of astronomical calendar. Which I suddenly remembered a conversation... Uh, when I suddenly remembered a conversation I had with another replica when I was inspecting the mining site. However, it was clearly a model I have never seen before, some sort of engineer with an orange chest piece. In my memory, she was just another member of our staff, but no such replica was ever stationed on Sierpinski. Replica memory is not the most reliable, they say. But never have I experienced such a strange phenomenon. Ooh. The little enigma of the box could only distract me from the chaos around me for so long. All the box contained was a small notebook, of which all pages turned out to be blank. It has been miserable since our beloved commander has fallen ill. I long for her stern guidance, that overwhelming authority in which she bathes a room. So that's the commander, who also had dreams of the white woman. More sick, making my work harder, uh, ever harder. How are we meant to shoulder this workload with no reinforcements? My only consolation is that our, as our protector staff decreases, so does the workforce we oversee. While more and more replica end up in the hospital wing, Gestalt workers seem to succumb much too fast for any attempts at treatment. And then their diary filled, for no benefit but my own satisfaction. I have not ordered a new one yet, since I spent my saved ration marks on that marvelous looking fountain pen. But I guess I'll make use of that notebook. My man loves to write. Uh, overview Lester. A biomechanical with carbon fiber reinforced, a polyethylene shell, and titanium skeleton. We are 178 centimeters tall. A versatile combat engineer unit, uh, primarily designed for orbital service. These tough and stoic loners are best suited as specialist sappers and scouts. Their technical knowledge and combat capabilities make these units true survivalists, especially when in their iconic white and blue navy uh, uh, heavy combat configuration, which sports bullet-resistant armor plating on their chest and forearms. Since the original neural pattern for this unit was lost with the destruction of the com uh, Central Neural Archive on Veneta, new Lester units uh, have been produced based on a decommissioned unit from the Penrose program. Oh. So they're a copy of a copy. I'm sure that does wonders for them. Hey, that's the same symbol we saw on the Infinity Tablet. Or not Infinity, the Eternity. Ahem. Excuse me. I apologize, chat. I've... I've... Fuck it up. Yeah, essentially, Nave. Uh, it's going great for them, I'm sure. I'm a little annoyed by that. Hey, 
hey ma'am, you want to talk about it? Wait, give me a sec. Replica known issues part four. Previous experience with this replica model uh, has given us insight into regularities and their pattern and their behavior that stem from original neural pattern used for this unit. Due to the sense of nature of this information, this document should be destroyed immediately after release. The Calibri. Great care should be given to Calibris. Their neural patterns are very unstable and their bioresonance module makes them very susceptible to influence from others. Like most bioresonant module individuals, uh, Calibris will often subconsciously create an emotional feedback loop, imitating and then broadcasting the emotions of those around them, acting like a sort of amplifier. While they are trained to recognize and disengage this behavior, already unstable units can sometimes spiral into a persona degradation. Uh, due to their bioresonant connection, neural pattern development in Calibris varies less than other model than in other models. The constant exchange of memories and emotions between the units uh, of a cadre as, as, acts as a safety net that buffers extreme changes. Yes, Marathian persona. However, once a majority of, of uh, units in the cadre de, uh, <laughs> degrade, they will drag remaining units down with them. Because of this, it is important to decommission Calibri units instantly when they begin to degrade. For persona stabilization, Calibri have a, should have access to a well-stocked library. Are you a Calibri? You are. Oh, you can tell? What gave it away? And ma'am, if you so desire, I can do you a solid. Okay, I have room. Oh, I see what I need to do. Okay. I understand the minigame. I'm very smart. My brain is fucking gargantuan, chat. Did you know that? My brain is so, so girthy. Oh, hey, it's the king in yellow. That's not some bad fucking juju. Oh, hey, look, it's Mina. Let's see. Biomechanical with high security, reinforced armor plated servo shell. Ooh. Generation 3 industrial specialist. 260 centimeters. God damn, that's one tall lady. <sighs> Sorry, I needed a, a sippy. When it comes to dangerous cargo, heavy machinery, and hazardous environments, no other model rivals the minor the minor unit with their high security power armor bodies. Even in lethal radiation, under crushing pressure, and in zero-g, they keep their calm demeanor and show exemplary teamwork. Despite their hulking bodies underneath their face shield, a standard Generation 3 cranial construction can be found, making maintenance and social interfacing as easy as with any other replica model. Please note, minor neural the minor neural pattern is not suited for combat use. For combat application, the Sapper variant has been used, it should be used, which employs a combat-capable persona in the same frame. For more information, see the whatever the fuck that is.
Look, they're a combination of like German. They're like pseudo fascists. They're not quite though, because it's it's there's some clearly meant to be like sort of pseudo communist shit thrown in, but whatever. It's a mess. Okay, let's go up to the next floor. <sighs> I don't want to go up further. Fuck it. Uh, do I need to save? Ah, uh, we'll do it anyway. Yeah, I, I could feel in my bones that that would happen. Oh, it did, Nave. It did, but... There's other things that, that give it that vibe, but whatever. It's, it's a mix of things. All of them terrible. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything. Also, when I say communism, I mean specifically like Stalinist shit. Before we get into that argument. Ma'am, stream all you want. It changes nothing. Oh, bitch. Hey, Yami. We got to open a copy of The King in Yellow, and it had... This. It's true, nothing has ever, ever happened that's bad with an astrolabe. Okay, you know what? I, I don't have the patience for going back. So let's, uh... Oh. Eh, fuck it. We'll do it legit. I'm on screen. Astrolabe should be this room right here. So we want to wait for Heimat to be at the northernmost point. Lung doesn't matter. Lung is fake and not real and fucking bullshit. Okay. I more or less have it lined up. Oh, 
Oh no, it's very easy to brute force. There is no punishment for failing, I think is the problem. One, one could argue. I don't care that there's no punishment for failing. But I may as well just show off how to fucking do it. Okay, so we want... There you go! A shrine diary, the shrinery if you would. I've started yet another new diary. How time flies. The work is dull and monotonous as ever in Sapinski. But a bright light illuminates my day. Today I was invited to a meeting with Commander Falk. And she was as magnificent as ever. Oh no. He's a bootlicker. Another day passes. During my meeting with the commander today, I felt the strangest sense of familiarity as I sat with her. Sadly, our meeting was interrupted by an unexpected power outage. I've been feeling strangely paranoid these days. Never before have I felt so strong in the sense of deja vu as I have these past few days. When I checked the pages of my diary today, I noticed for some inexplicable reason, I seem to have dated my previous entry with today's date. What an embarrassing mistake. Every day feels a bit- oh yeah, look at that. Every day feels a bit like I've lived it before, and even stronger is the sensation that something is, somehow, just slightly out of place. Why is my diary filled with entries I cannot recall writing? Why are they all dated to today? Has the loss of my beloved commander finally gotten to my mind? Am I going insane? Fear what will happen if, uh, to me if anyone finds out. I'm alone in this. If they discover my notes, I'll be decommissioned too. Something is wrong, I can feel it. Is this really madness? When I read the pages of my diary, I recall events that never happened. Uh, yesterday it never was, yet it feels as real as the one I actually experienced. This cannot merely be a defect of my mind. Yeah, it's not me that's wrong, it's everyone else! It feels as though this, uh, in this room, I appear into another version of reality. How? I do not know. Perhaps I too have become sick like the others, without realizing, but I will not succumb. It's all accumulation of reproduction errors, a gradual corruption of information, a story misremembered slowly morphing into each retelling, like genetic material mutating and evolving, like the replica mind copied over and over from an aging template. I do not know, but I will find out. The answers lie below, I can feel it. Someone or something calls me from there in the mine. Okay. Well, he's having a good time, it looks like. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to make a quick safety save just in case. Game! What the fuck? For reference, the game fucking launched me out into that lady. I'm maybe a little bit miffed about that. And you'll be like, Torpo, you have healing items, why don't you heal? Shut up! I'm just saying, that, that was some bullshit. Save over here. No, we're still being watched by the cameras. Me in. Let me. 
just want to go down, chat. And congrats on pack riding hard. I, I don't know what you mean by that. You know, I took- I made that save just in case, because I don't know if I'm going to be hurled directly into a boss fight. But I'm just saying, don't trust that man, he got an undercut. gonna get to fight Adler? Hmm, funny lit hallway. Man, what is with game devs in fucking basalt? Behold the hex grid future. It's true, Drag. I'm just saying. I'm just, I'm just saying. Thanks to video games, I've seen more basalt than I would ever care to. Hell yeah! Fucking Nitro Express, baby! Hey, homie, you want to talk about it? No. I'm a Lister unit. Hey, B.O. There's no you, Nave. It's it's Lister. So, did your face also fall off cuz it looks like you got the blood problem? And I know that other unit also had the blood problem. Hell yeah! Let's see, we got rifle ammo. And we got a flare gun. I 
I mean, maybe, Nave, but last I checked, the robots aren't eating other robot brains, so... Or other robot meat, I should say. Melina's diary. It's worse than I thought, everyone has disappeared. I still haven't found any trace of Lester. Lister, excuse me. It's as if she had never been here. Something's wrong with the protectors, those that are still around. The guard spotted me earlier, sneaking out of the medical wing, and she let out a monstrous scream as she chased after me. When I looked back, I saw her face, and now I can't forget. It looked like she'd been in some horrible accident. Oh, well, it sucks to be her, stupid bitch. Why did I do that? Why do I insist on touching things? I don't even know where I'm going. I'm fucking fumbling in the dark. The one upside to this area being so fucking big is I can do proper stealth. Like that! My one issue is there's no way to zoom out. Oh, I see. This is the game we're gonna play now, huh? So I've gone way too fast through this area, I am realizing, and I am just like, skipping shit. Yeah, okay, because that's the way to where Adler is, and Adler's definitely a boss now. Oh, I 100% did. So you know what? Uh, let's get a fun little look at the boss before I jump down and die. Shut up, Marathian. I managed to beautifully, perfectly, just zoom my way up here. Just no time wasted, holy fuck. Time to get supremely fucked up. No. Oh. oh, come on! Chat, I've made too much progress. I should just fucking close, just jump to the main menu and cry. Cry big old bitch baby tears. Yeah, you know what? It's like, if I'm gonna have to go through that kind of segment, I want to make sure I've cleared out everything so I don't need to go back through everything again. Uh, 
luckily I have a lot more room to futz around with. That way to the left. Oh, okay, cannot go this way. Basically, Nave. Yeah, okay, so I don't think I missed anything in this upper part, but I definitely missed some shit in the lower part. Because as far as I know, the, the only real split was that 50-50 split and the other split where the, uh... That, that funny lady unit, the big lady, the, the mining unit, the mining unit was vibing. Now, under the lamp in the save room. It would almost just be faster for me to go back to the main menu and reload at this point. But no, we are sitting on this fucking thing and we're gonna ride it out. Ride it out. Why did you reload? I guess maybe the boss, assuming there is one in that hole. Ah, uh, okay, you're one of those people. I try not to be obsessed with resources, but I try my best to clean up. Yeah, I can't, whatever, oh. It wouldn't let me pick that up for some reason. Do this save. Yeah, it wouldn't let me pick those up. They could only be picked up from a weird angle. Ooh, Eldritch. Non Euclidean pick up geometry. Okay, yeah, definitely next time I get a Twitch payout, I'm buying new headphones, because these ones are definitely starting to go. Uh, the wire in the left ear has been having problems, but now if I move the wire at certain angles, I just get, like, noise from it. Like, uh, like when you blow into a mic, that kind of thing. Okay, so I went up previously. Oh, the fence. Uh, thank you, hero. Jeez. Rip headphones. God damn. Holy shit. Uh, yeah. No, uh, I mean, the payout, next Twitch payout will probably be on the 12th, I think. Of November. Man, that's sick, dude. Thank you. Uh, no, it's not a removable wire. It's a wired headphone. Uh, I got it at the recommendation of a friend. Oh, man, that wire fucked me up. And they've been good headphones, they've been solid. But like, the problem is the, the wire internally is, I think, separating out at this point. I guess in part from being pulled in the way I've had to sit with it and all that. Uh, and so it's just been getting worse. Uh, initially it was... 
Give me a sec. Uh, initially, it was just a problem of... You girls doing good? Want to talk about it? But yeah, initially it was a problem of just like, if I sat at certain angles, uh, one, one side would cut out. I don't know why I padded on the side it was, you can't see it. And I don't have like fucking stereo mixing on my mic at the moment. I don't know why I fucking did that, but you get my point. Thank you, thank you, Marathian. Oh! That's weird. Oh, am I, am I, you don't want to tell me, am I intruding? Am I making this awkward? But yeah, so originally it was uh, one side just starting to give out, which still happens. But now, uh, just now, it got really weird because uh, apparently it's not just that anymore. It's now if I jostle the cable wrong, I get a tiny bit of like, let's get, I don't know how to describe it. It's like that sound that a, a mic makes when you just like pat on it. I'm not patting on my mic, by the by. I, I don't care enough to. I don't need a fucking showing. Yeah, basically, just, it, it, I wouldn't call it static either, but like, kind of like that. Yeah, I think I got everything. Wow, there's actually not as much as I thought there would be here. <laughs> Yo, gals. <laughs> I had iframes from grabbing that shit. Nice. just giving those out like candy now holy shit but yeah so I definitely next month when the twitch payout comes I'm definitely gonna buy new headphones these ones have been on the app for a while but I was able to tolerate to tolerate tolerate it because it was uh, it wasn't a big deal I, I just had to adjust the way I sat and all that but that's fucking whatever Now it's cutting out at certain angles, that way I I guess I can't put up with it anymore. Because yeah, uh, let me tell y'all the secret funny information. Monetization, let's, no, I don't care about that actually, it's analytics. Uh, earning, no, payouts is what I want. You want payouts? Yeah. Uh, next update will be the 12th of November, and that's when my next payout will be, without a doubt. Like, at my current rate- oh, fuck off. At my current rate, I get paid out, like, because I'm not super popular or anything, I get paid out, like, every other month.
Because that's about the pay rate for basically anyone who's anywhere in the range from like, we'll say 10 to 20, give or take. And that's where I'd firmly fall. Wang probably sees it monthly, because Wang gets a lot more traffic than I do. Along the shore, the cloud waves break. The twin suns sink, blank, blank, blank. The shadows lengthen. Sit. And I don't know the rates of anyone else. I think Bear is probably maybe comparable to me closer to Wang, but... I know a lot of my VTuber friends tend to get a lot more of that shit, though. There's a lot of people like the VTuber sphere, the, the, the larger VTuber sphere. Not the goon sphere that I stick around and tend to just really fucking throw money around like it's going out of style. So I'm gonna blank, 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 blank. Unsung is tears unshed shall dry and die. I know, Nave. It's a tragic. It, that's why you should tell everyone and tell them to tell everyone. I need more viewership, please. He calls me and a sea of flesh will become one, but I can never go back to being me. Is, is a sea of flesh, how would you describe a sea of flesh, chat? Is that just like a funny term for an orgy or like... So, there is definitely something down there. But I can't duck. I see you though, I see you. I do want to be famous, Marathian. Like, like, moderately. Like, enough that I can still read my chat. And not need to deal with the intense drama of the, the bigger people. I don't need to be huge. I don't want to be huge, huge. Too much effort, too much trouble. So, like, I definitely saw one of those things in there, and I... I don't think I could have gotten it, but I definitely saw it down there. Like, one of the tablets, that is. You're right, Hero, you're right. Yo, the vibes in this place uh, could best be described as fucking rancid. You're right. You're right, Marathian. Ooh. And the darkness of the dead shall be offered, a light and holy spices, so that they may find a way out of this cursed place. I don't know, I think it seems lovely here.
I would not vacation here, but I also just don't have vacation money. That's kind of the important thing here. I have nothing against the place. It seems lovely. Like, I don't have the money to vacation here. I am fucking loaded. I fucked up. I like the part of the soundtrack that sounded like someone just honking on a fucking bike horn. Am I, am I the only one who caught that? No, Vintage Silent Hill is a man just clattering fucking metal for ages. I have seen the instrument used to produce Silent Hill music, and it's funny as fuck. Get tased, bitch! Ooh! Now I'm excited! I'm so proud of this mine for having its very own fleshy orifice! Chat, can you believe it? So, I can't believe that... I can't believe the higher-ups actually let them install their very own giant fleshy orifice. I'm impressed. Like, it usually takes a lot to get the higher-ups to agree to it. I know this because I've had to do it before. Back at my old job. Took fucking months of requests over and over, almost daily. Before they finally let us install our very own fleshy orifice. It was worth it. In the end, it was absolutely worth it. But man, it was a lot of work. Right, Crow? I mean, ultimately, that's just that, that's just like sex tourism, and I don't know. I don't know how a hundred percent on board I can say I am with that. No, my coagulin! I see, Nave. This explains a lot. 
I need to then talk talk to Bear and ask him why Serbian dick is in such high demand. It's like, hey Bear, Bear, I need I need to know why are women so hot for Serb dick? And he'll just like he'll he'll have this look on his face. Like I won't be able to see it. But I know that'll just be like looking at me incredulously through the internet. Hot Serbs in your area. I'm sure I will, game. Uh, let me check my notes. Notes, what do you say? Nothing. Worthless. Shit. Shite. Trash. Okay, I understand what needs to be done here. Right try? Ma'am, I'm fucking busy. Seriously. It just sounds like someone honking a bike horn. Why is there a bike horn? Okay, so I need spices for the dead. Are oh, you like my fucked up Dharma? Aha. Well, there's nothing on the inside. Yeah, it's supposed to be a, uh... First Godal. <sighs> I'm gonna go need to check out that wedding band. That sounds disgusting, Marathian. It sounds perverse and unacceptable. Uh, I don't like it.
Chad, I found it. I found the one ring. Now I get to be paid a million dollars by some magic nerd. God, magic players are fucking losers. That's saying something for me. Uh, Sauron was... I'm sorry to tell you, that was Sauron's cock ring. Sauron wasn't marrying anything. Quite the opposite, really. You had innocence? Damn, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna make a quick save and just see where the flesh pit takes me. Because I clearly have a bunch of questions with no answers at the moment. That is true, Nave. That is true. But I feel like you've been on the internet long enough at this point to... While you- while ignorant... Not- not be... Innocent. There's a difference. Ooh. Hey chat, do you know these guys are Silent Hill fans? I, I mean, I bet you couldn't tell. But I figured I'd let you know that this game was inspired by Silent Hill. Yeah, I know. I know, chat. It's it's amazing. Yo, what the fuck? Hey, did I fuck up? I want you to know that I did that entire boss fight with the single handgun. I want you to know this. Behold the flex, I guess. Uh, 
I'll be right back, though. black jacket. Actually, you know what? I, I think I can go a little bit longer. Wait, whatever happened to the picture? Chat. I just realized that my picture is gone. She's not dead. She shot herself. Look at that cool dude! I like that one. Okay, she fired at the thing and it knocked her out. Because she had a gun way too fucking big for her. I think I'm gonna put the handgun away for a bit. The handgun did some good fucking work earlier. Little Mr. Handgun, you did good work. You get a break. Also, the corpse isn't here, chat. I didn't mean to use that. Ooh, the Regent's Ring. Look at that. I just replaced the two shells I spent. I probably should, Marathian, but I also have enough supplies that I'm not gonna sweat it. I know this hurts some people, but like, I have played enough fucking survival horror at this point that like, I trust my gut on this sort of thing.
I do like the, hey, were you smart enough to bring your fucking flashlight? Ah! If you were, congrats, you can see these a lot easier. You know what, Nave? I, I don't think I might. Oh, right. This thing can get stupid amounts of distance with its attack. Come on, Leggy Peggy. Uh, it does, but also it's important to remember, Nave, that having the flashlight on makes it easier for the enemies to notice you. You know, kind of a big thing. You can't really stealth around with the flashlight on. Is the stream lagging? That would be weird, because I haven't dropped any frames. Oh, I know what's happening. See if that fixes it at all. Yeah, I might be getting an encoding overload. Yeah, let me know if that fixes it at all. Shouldn't be getting an encoding overload. Yeah, just let me know if these sorts of things start to happen and I can try my best to fix them. Oh, that healing item is a trap. I see. Yeah, uh, basically a problem I have noticed, and it's one I can't really fix readily. But uh, what was I going to say? Uh, mm, that's number two. Uh, fuck, I completely blanked because I needed to say something else because I'm a fucking streamer and what I do is talk nonstop. Mm, okay, so basically, uh, an issue I've had, and it's one that I can't remedy pretty easily or anything, uh, because ultimately it's, I would need a lot of money to change it, uh, and fix it. Uh, which is basically, OBS has been requiring more and more and more resources as time has gone on. Not terribly surprising, obviously, but it is a problem. And unfortunately, that would mean basically getting and building a new computer. Which, I can't do because I don't have the money for that and I won't... And I do not for the foreseeable, like for the near future at least. I have no way of, at the moment, readying that pro uh, remedying that problem. Because basically, encoding overloads happen when basically 
OBS is too fucking hungry in trying to eat more than my computer can give it. Uh, yes, Black Jacket. And it's something I've noticed over time that OBS has been devouring more and more and more and more fucking, uh, CPU. It is a hungry bitch. So yeah, that's, at least for me, the primary cause of encoding overloads. It's basically my computer not being able to keep pace with OBS's needs and... As well as, you know, video game needs. But yeah, it's, it's probably something to do with the shaders they use here. Uh, no, Marathian. That's actually because, uh... That's a funny one, actually. That's not they're getting their cell phone to do all the computations. It's a lot of VTuber software, uh, runs through the capture on their phone. Uh, because of the way modern phones work. Uh, particularly iPhones. Uh, they're largely required for a number of, of those sorts of applications. Due to the facial recognition tech that they employ. It's, it's fucking weird. That's specifically why. Uh, and particularly the iPhone has its own special fucking breed of shit that it uses. That is basically more or less required by certain software to function at peak. A prison from which only to escape his death, deep below the dreamer floats in the sea of flesh. The red eye birthing a new world from their dream for eternity, and each time the dreamer turns over in their sleep. The world turns over too, until only flesh remains. Ooh, I love flesh. Huge, huge fan of flesh, personally. I don't know about you, chat, but I'm a big fan. So the Raid Regal, how's it going? How was your stream? I'm busy trapped in meat. Not a huge fan of being getting eaten by Flash Black Jacket, but that that is a specific act. I'm talking. I'm a huge fan of the concept of meat. Yes, yes, I am Raid Damn you, defective lock. Oh, 
did say that it wanted spices for an offering. And salt is a spice. Smelling salts are basically a spice. Light and holy spices, so they may find a way out of this cursed place. Smelling salts are basically spices, fuck you. Oh nice, congrats. I guess. I've never actually played Shattered Memories, I'm not super familiar with it. Same, Marathian. Tell me about your love of piss. Yeah, it sounds neat on paper. Yeah, no, I've actually never played Shattered Memories. I've only played to completion for Silent Hill games. I've technically played five of them, one of them being uh, The Room. But uh, I never finished that on stream. I never finished it off stream either. Yeah, it, it sounds neat on paper. I just don't know how I would react to it. Granted, I know I don't get as into horror stuff as some people, even if I enjoy playing it. What I mean by it is like, I, I'm not... In case it hasn't been obvious over the course of the many horror game streams I've done, horror doesn't really affect me that much. If at all. Yeah, I don't I don't really watch Void Burger Crow. So mm. Damn. Right now. Marathian. I like the second Silent Hill movie. I don't think it's good, but I remember liking it. It's bad Silent Hill, though. I need to clarify that. It is bad Silent Hill. <laughs> Come on, ladies. Same rage rail. But I wouldn't talk about it here too much because I am actually putting it on this Friday in the Discord. Funny enough. Speaking of... Ladies? No, they're- don't you dare learn! You split up, I will be very cross with you, miss. Okay, I'm good. Hell yeah!
I mean, everyone should be interested in oiled up pyramid head. If you're not, why are you even here? Can you truly call yourself a Silent Hill fan if you're not interested in jacked, oiled up pyramid head? The answer is no. No, you can't. What video game movies would you consider to be truly unfun kind of bad? I don't know, because I haven't actually watched that many, to be honest. I think the earlier Resident Evil movies are better than the older, the later ones though. The, the later, the older ones now. The, the later ones, uh, also in part because, you know, You know, the whole death thing. And the maiming thing. I, okay, you know what? No, I will say this, I will say this. The first Doom movie is at least fun. The second one is boring as fuck. Oh my god, is the second Doom movie boring. No, Duke Nukem never got a movie. That wasn't... I mean, wasn't uh, House of the Dead also Uwe Boll? So, like, yeah, kind of anything by him was fucking guaranteed to be trash. Boom! Finish, finish. Find this. Damn, I can't combine the wi the wings? I can't combine the wings, chat. Look, there's only one thing that Uwe Boll one good thing that Uwe Boll ever did. And that was beat the shit out of low tax. Everything else, terrible. That is true, Knave. That is true. And we... Fucking Pixels. Thank you for reminding me that existed. That time that, uh... Oh, fuck. Who was it that fucked Hubert? That's a thing that happened, unfortunately. Was it Adam Sandler who fucked Hubert? I thought it was someone else. Uh, there was that one Chun-Li movie. That was fucking atrocious. Or whatever that's worth.
You know what, chat? You're just going to look at this and you're going to like it. I will be right back. While you talk about terrible video game movies. Like that Chun-Li movie.
chat, I want you to know that I, I don't have par- like, yeah, I don't have Party Dog stuck in my head anymore. Instead, I have a different fucking Tom Cardi song stuck in my head, which is, Your love is not enough. I want some cool shit, too. And I feel you all should know that. I just- I feel all of you should understand and know that fact. That is- that is what's going through my head, uh, as we play through this segment of the game. Uh, mixed messages is pretty good. I do agree. Hey, ma'am. You doing okay? I think she's doing fine. Stay the fuck down, bitch! Okay, so I needed the key over this way. The other day. Get the fuck up, Nave. Hey, losers. Don't say that about the lock. Right, that's what I was gonna do. Later, bitch! I want those fucking grenade shells. Shit piss. I'm not going back in the funny orifice chat, just know that. Uh, I, I want you to know, chat, that apparently I could have done this at any point. I also want you to know that this is starting to harmonize with my tinnitus, and I don't like that fact.
Oh, yeah, no, I've just been screenshotting shit. I want you to know that, chat. I'm not, like, trying to memorize this or anything. It's true, I'm not powerful enough to memorize. I'm also not stupid enough to try to memorize. Why would you ever want to listen to a classic rock station? I take proper notes for games all the time. How dare you? How dare you? Here in my own goddamn house. Lock is def- Stop shit talking the lock. That's very rude. Okay, so that should be. Damn, I'm good. Ooh. Look at it pulsate. So, something that annoys me with this game, I just, I feel worth mentioning, is when the game decides, uh, that you just, you, you stop aiming at this person. You're done aiming at them today. Can't aim at them anymore. You're gonna aim at this person instead. I'm like, no, I want to keep aiming at this person. And they're like, no, you're not allowed to. <sighs> Let's see. On the first day, she was crowned. Ooh. On the longest day, nothing was done. On the next day, she was wed. On the last day, she took her life. Good for her. Nah, it's a mouse problem. It's- it's 100% a mouse problem. Fuck off! Ladies? Ah, she got me good.
Ah, uh, okay, so like, the only reason I know about, uh, like, I remember Nightmare on Elm Street Dream Warriors at all is specifically because of the song Dream Warriors by Dokken. <laughs> and I think that's more telling about me as a person. I've never actually seen the movie, but I, I'm very familiar with the song Dream Warriors by Dokken. I, I feel you all should know this. Obviously, left hand is the wedding band. No. Did I get the fingers wrong? Oh my god, I'm fucking dumb. No, no, I'm not. Whatever. I'm gonna leave the rings there. I understand the puzzle now. I, I get it. Uh, tragically, what it means is I don't have the means to finish it yet. This bitch had a lot of fucking rings. That's my takeaway, everyone. I don't know about you, but that's that's what I've learned, at least. Look, man, thumb rings are purely for the nouveau riche. Let's be real here. Anyone worth their salt? Any fucking blue-ass motherfucker? Yeah, it's the, nobody likes the nouveau riche. The only people who like the nouveau riche are the nouveau riche.
Okay, I guess I'm not doing the way I thought I would do this. Come on, everybody! Oh, oh, I fucked up. Is that like how the, the Babadook is a Bicon? Moravian. I'm just saying, everyone knows the Babadook is a Bicon. Just like Salem the Cat. I love how often this game just loves- just loves to thrust me out headlong into oncoming traffic. I took this because it was a shortcut chat. I want you to know that. Hey Issa, you doing alright? You doing okay there, girl? Okay, so let's look at my notes again. This one here's our pickaxe. Whoops. Hey man, which way you going? Uh, I appreciate that the 2022 Scream movie has an entire fucking commentary on what kind of horror- Oh, shit, she's still alive. Uh, Babadook is? And I mean that in a good way. The Scream 2022 is unironically very good. Okay, but like the Bye Bye Man gave us that one fucking incredible piece of art, the Pee Pee Poo Poo Man. It's like you can't be all bad, right? He won't be laughing when he comes to get you. Okay, see this? Uh... Oh, I see. I understand the puzzle. Also, Chad, I want you to know one thing I hate about this area specifically uh, is the fact that whenever you get thrown into a room, specifically whenever you get thrown into a room, uh, it shows you the the exact op fucking exact exact opposite angle that you should be entering in. So if you entered a door where you should be coming in from the right, you come in from the left. Did I fucking okay? I did. It was in that moment that I realized I don't have enough sprays!
Okay, we are back in pistol territory, baby! Pistol reign supreme! Yes. Like, it should have been obvious to me when, you know... It didn't have a face, but I thought that was an aesthetic choice, you know? I thought she just... They, they chose to not give it a face. You know, to keep it with the whole uncomfortable fucking theming. But no, apparently I'm the wrong one here. Apparently, I'm the fool. Now, a meat map is about what states or countries serve what kind of meat. Like, what, what ones they do best. Idiot. Is this... Yeah, okay, I don't care. Okay, I'm missing a funny door. And I finally realize what one it is. I don't need those flares! Flares are for the flare gun, which I have not used even once. Also, I have no clue what you mean by now we know what the, the smelling salts are for. Oh my god, I'm stupid. Oh my fucking god! I'm gonna just go fucking in the meat pit and cry. I want you to know that I don't see smelling salts and immediately think, ah, this will wake someone up. Which is firmly a me problem, I might add.
Ma'am, you don't see me. I'm busy. Yeah, it's me, Lister. Yeah, no, no, seriously, chat, genuinely, it is a me problem. I didn't see smelling salts and immediately think, ah, this'll wake someone up. No. Keep up, bought up, butthole. How's it going? How's it going, Wang? How was your stream of, I'm guessing, Moonring? Moonring being butthole. Just, just want to mention that. Oh, Limbus Company. Oh, they put out the new event, didn't they? Hmm. Okay. Uh... Do I, do I truly, wholly, and completely really want to bring pistol ammo with me from here on out? Not really. We're, we're going, we're bringing the big boy. Not the biggest boy. The biggest boy is without a doubt, no question, the rifle. But the big boy is the shotgun. Now there's the bigger boy, which is the flare gun. Later, losers. Yes, I, I do have... I have basically all of the guns I could get so far. As far as I know. I have the rifle, I have the flare gun, and I have the revolver. And I have the shotgun, and I have this dumb fucking rinky-dink pistol. Oh, she's gone. That bitch ditched me! The fuck? Oh? I did not find the Uzi, I'm sorry to say, Morathian. Uh, Robot Lesbian Horror Game is going fine. I'm currently neck deep in meat, but like not in the way I ever wanted to be, which is the tragedy. And then I remembered that I forgot to equip the shotgun. I wonder. Well, we want to go over here. So is this an offering? Damn it! These fucking dead people are too choosy. Uh, that's for you to never find out, however. That is between me and God and nobody else. How's that for an answer? This isn't even the good meat dimension. You know what? Good for him, however. Yeah, I don't know how far I am in, but I've I've been going. I've been I've been moving. I I be schmoving. Hey friends, you want to talk about it? I 
I don't think they want to talk about it. Motherfucker, why are there so many of you? Seriously, part of this track just sounds like someone's honking on a bike horn. And I will die on this hill. Oh, fuck me running. Game, please stop switching. Okay, so we want 202. Sweet Jesus! Yeah, I couldn't just rush over in time to uh, get the thing. Hey, is there any healing in here? Look, I couldn't just go back and get more health. Oh yeah, I found some incense. Yep. Okay, how long has it been since I'm dead? How long has it been that I'm down here? How did I get here? Where is this place and why am I here? My memory feels so blurry as if I've always been here, forever. Even my hair is slowly turning white. I remember my name and I remember my life. But I also remember a different name and a different life. And it feels like the line between her and me is blurring the longer I stay here. Alina. Congrats, Alina! It sucks to be you. Lock is defective. Ugh. Fuck. Well. Time to haul ass. Haul ass. Haul ass. Fuck that. Let's just make an easier route. Anyway. God, it's fucking dark in here. No, it's it's fine. I just need to light some incense. 
You'll love me for it. Oh, I love the plate of love. Delicious. So I think I have all six plates at this point. I'm gonna check the safer route. No, it's dark because I turned off my flashlight. Excuse me, my, my, my flashlight. Okay, so. I have a. No, I don't have everything yet, but that's why I need to offload the serpent ring. Where do I. Uh, fuck. Okay, I know where I need to offload the serpent ring. Uh, before we do that. Whoops. And then I will have all six. Can't hit the buffet yet. I don't have all the meat plates, just most of the meat plates. But baby, we're here for the midnight meat plate. Okay. I chose the wrong door. No, I chose the wrong door. Door, 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 door. And that's backwards. Yeah, I remember where I need to go now. I remember where I need to go now, actually. Shit. Yeah. Midnight Meat Plate is the name of my punk band. Thank you. No, I, I know the way. I have it memorized. Ooh, nope, 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 nope. Not dealing with that shit today, bucko. Okay. <laughs> we go all the way over here. Scream all you want, it means nothing. Kind has no place here, creature. Okay, you, you are being removed. I have gained knowledge. I mean, there, there's a reason for it just smacking steel, and that's because they're just imitating Akira Yamaoka's work in fucking Silent Hill. Just like so much of this game is aping Silent Hill. Unapologetically. And you know what? That's fine. That's cool. I am down for it. Okay, chat. So it's time to get fucking stupid. Because I'm an impatient asshole. In case you y'all didn't know that. You should know that. I'd be worried if you didn't know that. Made a loser. Ah, shit. She's just gonna see me anyway. Fuck it. Whoosh! Okay, we're out. I'm telling you, part of that track is just a fucking bike horn. For some godforsaken reason, they decide to include a goddamn bike horn.
Get out! Everyone's favorite song, Eternity. I love love. And flesh. Two great tastes that taste great together. Hey Adler, you don't you don't look so good. Lister doesn't care? I don't know what any of that said. I don't speak German. The fuck do you think I am? Lister is just here to party. there, Lister. What you think about? I'm Lister. Ooh. Working on it, Chief. You're gonna need to give me a minute. I don't know what that means. It's the white lady they talked about. Okay, so some... Yeah, Alina Sayo. Her name isn't Elster, it's Lister. How dare you get our name wrong? Marianne Young. I'm guessing that's the name of our original, uh... <laughs> Be not afraid. Fuck you. I too feel like a bunch of paintings. Thinking about that ship. Still got no feet though. That's how you know she's a robot. Buddy, I wish I was asleep. <laughs> I love Ghost in the Shell. Lady, your leg stubs still work. You can get up. Wait, what? I 
like I missed something here. Feel like I missed something. Is that actually it? Wait a minute. Done here, don't seem kosher. That's weird, I have all these things I shouldn't have. Lister, did you do something funny? Hey Lister, what's that hole right there? We, we gotta talk about the funny hole? Also, this is definitely not the layout of the ship when I did it the first time. Ooh, Operation Penrose. Nothing but stars. Also, this is the track that plays on the title screen. This specific number station. Marianne's been working on a painting. Good for her. Uh, running out of ochre paint. Uh, Lister laughed when I told her. Now I have to mix it myself. So annoying. Still haven't read a whole bunch of those manuals. I feel like they gave me enough to read for the rest of my life. Most of them are boring technical manuals anyway. They could have given us more films to watch instead. Half of them are war films, which Lister doesn't like. And the other half are kitschy propaganda dramas. Chat, let me tell you about my hatred of number stations, because they just make me uncomfortable. And like, I'm glad the dev understood how uncomfortable number stations are. Nobody in either chair.
Let's just enjoy this beautiful radio play. Windows briefing phase two. For our calculations, 1500 cycles of mission time will have passed when you receive this message. Congratulations, comrade! By now you should have become fully acclimatized to your new life on board your ship. As you approach the Oort Cloud, your search for new worlds will begin. Utilizing the long-range sensors, you will you're, you will scout for valuable resources, habitable worlds, or signs of alien life. Remember to rely on your replica to assist you in maintaining your vessel. We all wish you great success in your mission. Uh, do you enjoy the calming tones of this number station? It's it's soothing, isn't it? Ooh, the emergency cryogenic hibernation unit. Case of medical emergency that cannot be treated on board, Gestalt crew members can be put in a hibernation here. Cool! I also hope we never need to use it, though I'm sure we fucking will. Oh, look at the cute little house plant. Let's see. Yeah, I think we've officially looked at everything. Ooh, a sealed envelope. Chat, should we open the envelope? What do you think? Should we blatantly ignore our 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 orders? <sighs> You're right, chat. We weren't made to be some weak ass bitch. Orders blow. Replica known issues, Panorama's program. Yada yada, throw it away, we already went over this. Uh, Lister units were chosen for the Penrose program for their adaptability and reliability under long-term isolation conditions. Stoke and reserved, Lister units have a relatively stable neural pattern. It's best for you to leave it alone and interact with the Lister unit as little as possible. Lister's neural pattern was a soldier of... Benedin? Benedin. We'll say Benedin. Benedin origin! So their needs are basic. Avoid talking to the Lister unit about the war. Penrose vessels are fitted with a specialized calibration pod, which may help with the persona stabilization. To avoid resurfacing of Gestalt memories, do not show or give the Lister unit photographs, especially of soldiers during the war. Do not show the Lister unit motives. Uh, movies, excuse me. Do not show the Lister unit movies or let it listen to music. Do not try to befriend the Lister unit. Whoops! Been watching movies with that Lister, huh? Chronometer adjustment. Medical Service Record Scout Officer Young Arian. Arian. Ariani? Who cares? Officer's note. Uh, I have adjusted the ship's internal clock to run slightly slower. By my calculations, each cycle should be exactly 6.13% longer. Uh, simulating what I believe is the length of a day on Venita. Uh, I wonder if Lister will notice the difference. Judging from her accent, I'm sure that she's Venetan. She pronounces ship like Issa and Eri used to. It's very cute. Hearing her speak makes me dream of the ocean. I wonder if I'll ever get to visit something like it. Maybe on a distant world. Wait. How did you know Issa and Eri? We knew Lisa and Eri! We met! Er, Isa. I don't know about this one, Chad. This don't seem kosher.
Damn, I had to turn my radio. Hey, look, it's a lady with white hair. Wait. Our photo didn't have white hair. Oh no. No. Do not Mac on the replica unit. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. No, please don't do music. No. 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 Stop. I'm gonna just uh just Whoop, didn't want to You get a single a single point. Love wins, but DMCA wins more. Hey there, white-haired lady, you want to talk about it? Okay, so we're back on the ship. Except it's cold. And I'm dying. Smear diary page. Uh, tell whether wake or asleep anymore. Vision is blurry and my fingers hurt. My back hurt. My teeth hurt. Eyes hurt. Everything hurts. All the time. Can't go on. Please make it stop. You okay there, ma'am? I, I got a bad feeling here. Lost another tooth. There was much, so much blood. My hands were shaking. Why is my hair falling out? I can't sleep. I just want to sleep. Please let me sleep. Lock is defective. Requires a key, so I guess we got to go north. Oh, that don't look good. We gotta talk about this? Compartmentalizing trauma. Oh hey, it's the armor they talked about, the white and blue. Remember? Remember Adler wrote about that? I think it was Adler. Mmm, fleshy cryopod. Yeah, we're, we're now a heavy combat lister. Yeah, nothing to it but to do it. Oh hey, we're back here, except it's no longer as red and meaty. 
I'm going back over here though, because I remember something glowing under here. And I wonder if I can touch it now. I'll get there eventually, chat. Just you fucking see. I don't know why I'm holding shift like it'll make a fucking difference. There's no longer a red glowy thing under there. Tragic. I miss you, red glowy thing, wherever you are. I'm glad that we've managed to compartmentalize our trauma like a proper Lister unit. The way we intended. The way it was meant to be. You know, this place is actually quite nice at night. Very lovely. I love the... Is it snow or is it ash? Well, whatever it is, it's lovely. It's, it's beautiful. Those who sing the same song have heard it in their dreams. A dark tone at the edge of hearing. Silent voice whispering in my heart. Come join us. Together we'll be eternal. There will be no escape. We will be one. I don't... But I fear the dark sea that will swallow me. Yeah, you know what? Valid. Uh, I don't like it. Bad vibes. Something old, far older than humanity, sleeps deep below the ground. Those of us who can hear its call at night, in the night, an invitation. Notion of memories, where I ends and we begin. I don't like, I'm, I'm too big on my individuality, personally. Not a huge fan of becoming one of the chorus, if you would. Great holes secretly are digged where Earth's pores ought to suffice. And things have learnt to walk that ought to crawl. Okay, now you're just doing direct fucking... We should have never <laughs> never left the primordial soup. Only through death can I escape. And call the call of the one who rules above all life. Oh. Oh, hey, look, a red lantern. I'm sure that's not bad vibes. Night, Tyrion. Yo, chat, I think the vibes here might be fucking rancid. Mm, nah, I'm good. Chat, that's all I'm saying. I think the vibes might be rancid. Speaking of rancid vibes, that's a lot of skulls. I know, that's what I was- that's why I was saying that, Hero. That's why I was saying- oh, it's just direct. Yeah, I don't know, I'm- I'm not- I'm not- I don't think these skulls are a good sign. I think the vibes have officially chat- the vibes have officially turned rancid. I'm sorry, chat. Gestaltzer fall. Ooh. Oh, hey, it's just like the beginning of the game. I remember this place, except there's more meat now. Playing Orbital Interchange, S23, Serpinski Facility, Transit si uh, Station. Welcome to Serpinski Facility. It's good to be here. Yeah, I don't quite remember there being this much meat. Know what I'm saying, chat? I remember there being decidedly less meat the first time we were here. Uh, real, real meat infestation problem.
Well, that was pointless. I don't know, chat. How heavy duty do you think I should be getting at this point? Should we start bringing out the big boy, the big gun? I'm debating, chat. Yeah. You're right, chat. You're 100% correct. Look, Knave, I will do whatever I goddamn please with all this fucking ammunition I have. I have enough ammo to kill God, and I will fucking do it. This bitch right here? Fucking dead. Sir, how did you get faster than me? Oops, forgot to reload. You get a flare, and you get a flare! Okay. Also, how close would y'all say I am to the ending? Notes, notes, notes. None of these are in the notes. Okay, yeah, we can finish this on Monday then. Surprised that there's only been one boss so far though. I do want to say that. Well, I guess two, but I beat one of them with a fucking pistol. Yeah, it, it is two where I am, Tiger. Yeah, we can call it for here for now. You have to look at that flare gun. Yeah, look at that. Look at that saucy flare gun. Either way, though, I hope y'all had fun, because I know I did. This game's good. This game's fun. I'm glad I decided to do this as I crack my fucking knuckles. My knuckles. They're not mine, but you get what I mean. It's, it's fun. But either way, uh, fuck, I, I mean, not really many new faces around, I don't think, but either way, if you enjoyed the stream and don't follow, I'd appreciate it if you did, but most importantly, I hope you all have a good rest of your day, however much that might be. We'll be finishing this up on Monday. Yay. Look forward to Gestaltzer Fall. Yeah, Gestaltzer Fall. Uh, and then, I guess tomorrow, assuming bears up for it, is more Carrier, which... Is a game that exists. Another survival horror game. Much worse! Gestaltzer Fall. Gestaltzer Fall is just fun to say, honestly. Oh yeah. Either way. Have a good one, y'all. Bye bye Neat, however. Night, y'all. I'm not gonna raid anyone because I never raid anyone. Also, anyone I follow is probably already asleep. Either way, goodbye.